Hey, so I'm feeling a bit delirious. I was just watching Home and Away with a stapler in my hand, as you do, and uh, it was quite dramatic. Elliot was about to kill Nicole, and I was just sat like this. La la la, this is so dramatic. <laughs> On my finger, so I was like... I lost about seven pints of blood, so I was like, oh, and I was about to film a video as well, so I was going to show you on video, um, but I didn't think you'd appreciate that sight. Um, I've moved into university now. Here's a quick tour of my room. Yeah, I'm a little bit lonely, as the people who have been put with are all quite old postgraduates from Taiwan. They're really nice people. I just feel a bit young and out of the group. Uh, but there's more people who are going to be arriving soon and also I'm going to make friends on my course and I've got Andy and Christine here so I'm not like, oh my god, save me, I'm so sad. I'm quite a sociable person, I don't like being on my own for long periods of time or insanity does tend to follow. And here's a world exclusive, the nose watch. Now you can tell the time on your face. Da, 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 da. Where have I been? Well, I've been to New York, obviously, and you're probably sick of the New York videos now, but I just want to say I love you American people! I just want to wrap you up in a ball of cotton wool and send you down a giant hill. I don't know why I want to do that to you, but you're all really nice. Hug for America. Oh, on the plane! There was a man with a glass eye. No offence if you've got a glass eye, but his wife helped him take it out, and then she put this lotion in the hole, and I was like, Oh my god, I really shouldn't be looking at this, but I can't help but look up. It was so bizarre. And then she kept offering me these sweets every time I woke up. She was like, fruit sweet, fruit sweet. And I was like, no thanks, your hand's been in your husband's eye socket. 